Brandon, we obviously talked a lot about the offensive struggles, but when you see a runner second with no outs and a screaming line drive up the middle that becomes a double play, I mean, what's going through your mind then? Well, I just thought that was pretty bad luck there. I thought Tony Santander with nice job putting the ball in play with two strikes and a pitcher catching the ball off the ground on a line drive. That's, you don't see that very often. So just uh, bad luck from us, kind of the way he finishes his pitches where his glove was, was right where the ball was on the ground. Um, so nothing DJ Stewart could have done either and uh, just didn't go our way there. Rich Dubroff, go ahead. Uh, Brandon, what was uh, what, what are your observations on how Zimmerman pitched today? You know, without his best stuff today, I thought, you, you know, you saw more balls than, than normal. Um, I just didn't think he had his command. And with that being said, he goes five innings and gives up two runs. Gives us a chance to win. Uh, shows what kind of pitcher he is and what kind of pitcher he's going to be with going out there without his best stuff and only giving up uh, you know, a handful of hits and, and two runs. Uh, I just thought it was an out, it's outstanding the way, he's, the way he's pitching, the way he's keeping us in games. I love his pitch mix. I, didn't, I just didn't think he was as sharp today as he had been the last couple starts. But with that being said, two runs given up. You gotta, you're going to win more games than not um, when that happens. Nathan Ruiz, go ahead. Brandon Dunn was a guy who issued a lot of walks in his first start, and you guys weren't really able to make that happen today. Was he doing something differently, or is that on your, your hitters? No, I thought we were too aggressive on him. Um, he's got really good stuff. He's got a fastball. He did get ahead with his fastball a lot early. But we made a lot of early outs on him. Um, he's got a really good slider as well. But yeah, we you know we chased the slider off the plate a little bit, and uh, you know Galvis there jumped him for the homer. But um, he had better command than he had his last start against the White Sox. But um, you know it'd be nice to grind out the at bats a little longer, and and uh, especially in a doubleheader day when. You know, bullpen guys have already pitched. You want to try to get in the bullpen as much as you can. And and uh, I just thought we were a little aggressive early in the count on them. Joe Trezza, go ahead. Brandon, that being said, when you look at the offense, do you see any signs of, of guys who, who might be about to turn things around? Well, I thought, you know, I think we've had some guys with some tough luck, to be honest with you. Um, you know, for me, Franco swinging the bat better than his numbers have shown. Uh, it was good, nice to see Trey swing the bat like he did in that first that, in that first game. Like to feel feel like he's taking better at bats now. Um, you know, I think Santander. I'm not worried about him. He's going to take. Good, he's going to get hot here at some point soon and, and take some good at bats. DJ Stewart drawing a drawing a walk. They're late. That's what that's what uh, you know. He's really good at being being selective and and being able to work the count. I do believe that our offense is a lot better than, than how we're swinging the bat right now and we are going to turn it around.